working on a 350Z Nissan changing the oil sending unit it's underneath the car had to basically uh, take off the splash shield dust shield underneath the car it's on the passenger side as you can see the oil filter once you take it off take the old one out you unscrew it clean the mating surface down and then when you clean that down you want to basically put some silicone sealant on the new sensor and then you want to screw it back in plug it back in and then you're basically going to uh, uh, torque it down to 9 to 12 foot pounds and there you have it and then you basically uh, start it back up check your uh, gauge and see how that's working uh, if you need to basically do a uh, oil pressure check you're going to have, uh, I believe it's 13 at idle when it's warm, and it's going to go up to 43 at 2,000 RPMs. So, hope that helps you out.